Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Love by Chetanya Snurri and today we're gonna install the Global Elite ROM version 4.1 and the Global Elite ROM is a great ROM because it is really stable and it works really fine and it gives you a good battery life too. So it is generally based on the S7 Edge's firmware and it has the UI of the S8, the Samsung Experience version 8.1. So we're gonna install it today and see how it looks and how it actually works so right now i'm using the ultimate nougat a8 port and once again this rom is also very stable and if you want to check out its review the link to the video will be right over here this is a really stable rom and you might want to check it out so let's get into it so first of all we're going to turn off our device and you do need to have your device rooted and have a custom recovery in it and i've already made a video about how to root your galaxy s6 edge and have the twrp custom recovery on it so link to the video will be once again right over here just follow the video and you will get the custom recovery and the root so i'm just gonna go into the custom recovery now and to do that we're just gonna press volume up key home key and power key at the same time and now let go of the power key so the device is booting into the custom recovery and we're gonna go and wipe and we're gonna select the advanced wipe over here and we're gonna select the Dalvik RT cache system data and cache and we're gonna swipe to wipe. It is now wiping the device and it is done now and we're gonna go back back and back and we're gonna go and install and here we're gonna find the global elite ROM version 4.1 and this is a fixed version so there was a problem in the earlier builds but it is now fixed so it is the version 4.1 so the ROM does come with the Roma installer or some kind of installer like that so it is booting into that installer right now so we're gonna agree to this next and you have your information over here and we have already done the wipe so we can go ahead and select any of these so I'm gonna go with the clean install and here you're gonna select your model number so as you can see it supports many different models so that is really great so it would support a wide variety of the Galaxy S6 and the S6 Edge so I'm gonna go with the international S Galaxy S6 Edge which is mine over here so select next and here you have some mods that you can install so i'm gonna go with the s8 port camera just to see how it looks and you have divine beats mod it is like the viper for android but it is not actually viper for android so i'm gonna go ahead and install that so here you have the option to select font i'm gonna go with the stock and here you have the emojis option so i'm gonna go with the android o emojis then you have the boot animation and the select status bar clock position so i'm gonna go with right over here and select next so here you have more options so i'm just gonna go with the international csc and select next and here you have the applications the bloatware that you want to install that comes with the samsung phones so you can install that from over here i'm gonna go with the accessibility edge features push services quick find sdk app sim toolkit and smart switch support uh, volt e let's see if it actually gets the volt e working and then all share sound alive i don't really need then vpn support ussd code secure folder i'm gonna go with hello bixby always on display calculator app calendar clock and galaxy app store my files weather smart manager and next here you have two options to get the root access of your ROM so you can go with the super Su or the magic I personally prefer to go with magic because magic gives you the root access as well as give you exposed installer type features so you can go ahead and do that and on top of that with magic you can also use snapchat because it passes the safety net check so that is really great so I'm gonna go with magic and use the snapchat and the ROM is installing now it, it takes around two to five minutes to install the ROM so just keep your device aside and let it install the ROM so guys the ROM is done installing and we're gonna select next over here and we will reboot our device and the ROM is done installing now and the first boot up may take 10 to 15 minutes so don't be alarmed if it takes longer than usual so it takes around 10 to 15 minutes so we're just gonna have to wait for it to boot up so guys the device just booted up and we're going to quickly set it up and it is not that special so you have your basic setup over here so I'm going to just quickly set it up and see what it is all about. So guys the device is all set up right now and it just looks weird for some reason 
because there's no wallpaper and the UI is so big right now so I gotta reduce down the the DPI I'll show you how to do that in a second let me just try on a different wallpaper and see if there's a problem with the launcher or with the wallpaper or something so so guys the problem was with the wallpaper only so what I recommend doing right now is going to the settings and going into the about device and as you can see guys the device is really fast right now and does not experience any lag so as you can see the android version is 7.0 which is nuget and and you do not have any samsung experience version 8.1 or anything and you have the device model number of the g925 so that is the s6 edge so i guess the rom is based on the s6 edges firmware and have the theme of the s8 so it is great because it will be more stable than i thought it would be so let's go into the about device and tap on bill number and you go into the developers options what i generally recommend is reducing down the animation scale but they are already down so i'm just gonna increase the minimum width to 441 and it makes a huge difference i've done that already in many roms so as you can see it feels so much better now according to me but it is up to you if you want to do that or not i think it became too small for it so i'm just gonna decrease that a bit so i'm gonna go with uh, i think 410 so you have to play around with that to meet your ideal situation so i just did that and i immediately feel better so here you have the rom it feels really fast i must say that it does feel really really fast and you have all the applications over here so you have adway and all you have ge control so that all will be mentioned in the review and it will be coming really really soon so i think that's it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you're new here please subscribe to this channel and do follow me on instagram as well this is chitanesh noria signing off